everyone welcome back and thank you for watching another one of my grocery shopping haul videos hey hey how y'all guys doing hello my spirit boosters welcome back to my channel well today i want to share a little story that will tell you why I keep doing what I do. You see all my grocery haul items. Most of this stuff is from online. And some of it my husband got from the store. But anyway, let me tell y'all this little story. Once upon a time, going to the grocery store was so convenient. Now, it's not so reliable anymore. Oh, how we took for granted going to a fully stocked store to bless our every need. Now going to the store is depressing because you might not be able to get what you need. But wait, look, there's hope. You see one pack of toilet paper on the shelf. Yay! Only there's a granny headed toward that same package. You managed to get there first and grab it. Granny looks shocked. You kind of feel bad for her. She looks so sweet and caring. But you're not giving up that pack of toilet paper. Uh-oh. While you're twerking and celebrating getting some toilet paper, you've let down your guard and forgot that people can be desperate during these insufficient times. Sweet granny just pulled out a 22 and shoved it up your right nostril and dares you to take that last pack of toilet paper. You give it up. As you're turning to leave, you wish that you had a listen to people saying, stop the book up. Yeah, people, that story encouraged me encourages me to continue to stock my pantry with emergency and working products as you can see today i found a few more things some meat i got some spam some oven roasted turkey spam i got my husband some soup jazzy jambalaya with chicken sausages and ham and i got him steak and potato and some chicken and sausages gumbo Oh, I almost forgot. Let me put this down there. I also picked them up a pack of this uh, soup and oyster crackers. Some soup and oyster crackers. As y'all can see back there, I got some Sunny D. Because if they ever run out of water or whatever, I got to have something to sip on. Sunny D. I got some Sunny D. I got some Juicy Juice. Apple. What is that? I got Apple and I got Fruit Punch. 100% juice. No sugar added. And I finally got around to getting some roast beef with gravy. Never had any of these things, especially the canned meats. What did I show y'all the last time? Some canned ham. Never had that and never had this. So this is emergency food or who knows? We got to try it. And I got my husband some Denty more beef stew. And I did pick up me some few more cans of tuna. I got some other tuna. I just forgot to put it up here. I forget to put up a lot of stuff up here. And you guys know it's a holiday coming up. What is it? Uh, Labor Day? The first Monday in September, I believe. But anyway, I'm definitely baking a, one of these cakes. I got me a perf Duncan Hines Perfectly Moist Strawberry Supreme. That cake looks so good. Really, the packaging got me. Look how delicious that cake looks. And back there, I got that um, Super Moist Butter Pecan Cake Mix. It, I had a hard time finding that. I want to either make that one or this uh, strawberry cake or the lemon supreme cake. One of these cakes are being made on the next holiday, which is Labor Day. And you guys can see I got some icing. I collected some icing, strawberry mist, whipped frosting. Well, these are frostings. Cream cheese frosting. And you see I got the coconut pecan. That's going to go on that butter pecan cake mix back there. If I decide to make that one, if it's not the strawberry or if it's the lemon. So, yeah. Yeah, that story encouraged me to continue to keep prepping my pantry. 
And I hope that cur story will encourage some of you guys. Because we live in desperate times and people will do desperate things when it comes to the last of something. And you guys, all are witnesses. If you witnessed all that stuff that happened last year when the craziness got started. And it's not going to be any different this time. So keep stocking up your water and the tissue because you know what's happening. And I just want to cut this short right now. I just wanted to come in here and share with you guys that I'm still stocking my pantry. And I'm still preparing for insufficient food and supplies. We're in a crisis. Believe it. Don't take this stuff for granted. Get what you guys need. And that'll be it. Until the next time, my spirit boosting supporters, thank you. I hope this grocery haul was a pleasure to watch. And I hope it helped you guys remember something that you might have forgot to get from the store. Once again, thanks for watching.